I got a secret to tell you. It's a really good secret. I want to make sure you guys keep it to yourself. I don't know how many of you are going to get a chance to actually take advantage of this secret. But, uh... I found a beast. There he is. Got him, coach. A key to lead is freaking ridiculous. And me having him on my team so far is ridiculous. I mean, in the right zones or in the right man coverage, he catches balls. If he gets his hands on them balls, he grabbing balls, y'all. Especially if you send the heat and the guy rushes the pass and he don't know no better. A key to lead is going to come up with the balls. And I got two games for you in this one. Just two. That's all you need in your life is two games from here. Two and one. Why is it? Hit that curl route, please. That's Mackie, baby. And that's my phone. But if it ain't Mackie, it ain't me. Let me make sure I get that out of the way. This dude, Akeem Tlaib, is ridiculous. Just watch him work. First of all, how did he catch that first interception? Second of all, why is this young man looking to throw it his way again? Third of all, dude, don't look at the left side of the fit. Got him, coach. I just told you don't look. And he looked. This dude makes interceptions that he has no business making. Burnt on the play? Don't matter. Let him reach out there. He going to grab them balls. He going to catch them. And that's fine. That's fine. So let's see. Here we go. Game two. Let's see if he puts in the same amount of work. Let's see if he does the same. Hopefully we get a full game out of this guy. Judging by how much time we got, we're going to get a good amount of time. And he's testing them nice and early. I'm sorry, that's me testing him nice and early with Megatron. Y'all already know about the human highlight glitch. You throw it up to him, he's going to come up with them balls, and he's going to get the touchdown, or he's going to teabag somebody. Megatron be doing the most. But in a future video, yeah. I also got Andre Johnson on the other side of him. So we got a problem, Houston. We got a big, big problem, Houston. So here we go. He's looking to go deep. Bro, I'm not going to give you that much time. I ain't even send no heat on that one. This time, eh, a little bit, but it didn't get through. But Levante David comes up with the interception, tries to spin off a guy, and he gets tackled. Okay, okay, okay. Doesn't matter. We got the ball. We got the lead. And uh, let's see what we do with it. We hit Mackie across the middle. We're looking good. We're looking good. We have good pass completion percentage. We're hitting Megatron on the curl route. We're back in scoring range. And we got to see what Bo could do. We're going to hand that thing off to Bo Dallas. Bo Dallas stumbles along into the end zone. Pretty simplistic, right? Oh, God. There we got Burnt. Yeah. I had to leave on a, uh, a yellow route. So he wasn't really supposed to be going deep. So it looks like he got burnt, but he, trust me, he didn't get burnt. He was playing his own. His own just wasn't deep, and he went over the top of it. So, we come up with that sack. Back him up just a little bit. Push him back, push him back, way back. All right, that's what cheerleaders say when it's a penalty. And there he scores on a key to leave. All right, okay, cool. You got him that time, bro. He was in a deep blue. But look, we got Bo Dallas. And only wrestling fans are going to understand why I'm calling him Bo Dallas. You got a Bo Lee. Getting up the sideline. Finally, I'm getting some working with Bo. Bo's actually breaking off long runs. You know, is he breaking tackles? Not necessarily. And we're going to hit him again, and he gets completely demolished. First and goal on the one, and we're going to go right back to Bo. We got to reward that man for his efforts. Get him into the end zone. He got us down there. Let's go on ahead and make sure that he gets his justice and his reward for it. Justice for ju all right. Never mind. We'll leave that alone. That's a Jersey thing, and we're going right back after that, Vic. And we come up with yet another sack. Oh no, that's not how everybody uses their Vic. It seems like he's using them as a pocket passer, and we're making sure that he pays for it. There he is, going knees deep again, and good God, all right. 
This guy catches interceptions as if the ball is thrown to him. Akeem Tlaib is a beast. So now we go on ahead. Peyton Manning hitting Bo Jackson. And Bo Jackson is cooler than the other side of the pillow. Rest in peace to Stuart Scott. And we are up huge now. Up 21 in the third quarter. And he's going deep again in the key to... Bruh. <laughs> Chill. Stop throwing over there. <laughs> This guy, Akeem Tlaib, man, that's, I got to tell you guys, that is the football outside of Akeem Tlaib, I think it is. Either that or team of the week. I don't know. But what I do know is that the guy is a straight up animal. I can't believe how he catches interceptions. I can't. But now we're going to Bo and Bo puts the ball on the ground. Bo, chill. But he was down. We get the ball back and we're going to go right back to Bo. Bo getting the block. Bo to the outside. He gets tackled at the nine. And we're in scoring position again. Can we go up 28? We go right back to Bo and in, inside the five. And now, you know, it's that time. Go on ahead and do what you need to do. I'm pretty sure you have some festivities to get to, just like I do. Hope you guys enjoyed. That's all I got for this one. And if I haven't said it, Happy New Year.